of referring to someone's rear end. He said he doesn't want nobody who does that on his staff. Somebody who's always coming in telling them something to make him feel good. He says, I want somebody who'll come in and tell me the truth about how bad I'm doing in my campaign or how bad the war is going in Korea or something like that. Give me, some people even have a time through history said, give me the bad news first. I don't want to hear nothing about the good news. Good news will take care of itself. I want to hear the bad news because that's what I'm going to have to deal with. And the code position, I'm going to say this to all the audience right now, is strictly that. I mean, I don't mm -hmm. want to hear nothing about black people's progress. I'm not interested in that. That take care of itself. No parades or none of that nonsense, according to the code. That's nonsense. Let's look at the problems and roll up your sleeves and get with them. Eliminate the problems. No hallelujahs, none of that. Jubilee time can wait. We can get around to that any old time. Don't waste your time and energy talking about something that happened a million years ago. Use your time and energy now, because you only got but a little bit of time and energy. I know that's my case. I got just a little bit of energy right this minute. And, uh, and by being logical, my time is very, very short for me to be around on this planet. And to use that time sitting around talking about what my grandfather used to be is a crime against my creator. I'm not going to spend five minutes doing that. Ever. Of course, that's me. And that's what the code recommends. Don't spend not one ounce of time doing that. The counter races compensatory code. Spend all of your time trying to figure out how to get over that next obstacle on the one that's right there in front of you right now, rather than go somewhere and sit on a log and talk about the things that you used to do, or even the things that you did yesterday that need doing. Say, okay, I've been there and done that. What's the next problem? It's like the batter at the mound. Hey, throw the ball. Say, well, what about that ball last game? That was the last game. This is this game. Keep your eye on the ball. That's where that came from, that expression. Mm -hmm. You start thinking about what happened yesterday, you're going to lose a series. Well, I hope I, I, hope I made the point. Let me see. Um, uh, Charles, um, Charles, did that answer your question? Yes, yes, it, it oh. did. But I also was trying to find out, could we handle it? I don't think that we could. I feel like we couldn't handle it by looking at what's, what we're doing today. We need a code for handling problems. That's all. This is a problem. Black people are flatlined. We don't have anything to brag about. We're the joke of the entire world. So how do you get out of that? by solving problems. That's how everybody is, that's how a baby makes progress. We are babies. The baby falls down, but the baby holds on to the side of the crib, uh, you know, to the top of the crib, if the baby is in a crib. The baby didn't know that six weeks ago, maybe, but by trial and error, the baby could look through the bars you might say, and this definitely applies to black people. We're looking through bars. We're coming through the world looking through, through bars because we all got all kind of bars against us. But we look between the bars and we learn things like the baby does, looking through the bars of the crib, if they still have those type cribs. Mm -hmm. And the baby can see 
oh, that person is doing something that they later find out is a thing called walking. So the baby tries to turn over and get up on those legs and do what the baby sees other creatures doing. And the baby falls down and cries, but the baby gets up again. People have watched babies. Lots of people who are listening to this podcast have had babies, the females. They have watched babies. You can learn a lot from watching babies. And we're still babies. So that fundamental doesn't change. You fall down when you Mm -hmm. first try to do something you haven't tried before. But you get up. Next thing you know, the baby's on holding on to the rails on the crib. Say, oh, this is how you can stay up. And then the baby gets to the place where the baby can walk around in the crib like Mm -hmm. those other creatures do. Then the baby wants to do what? Get out of the crib. Get out of the crib. And yeah. walk around like those other creatures. But when the baby gets out of the crib, the baby starts falling down again. And it cries, and we cry. But we do what? Well, crying time is over. Time to get busy. Solving problems. Yeah. Because crying oh. ain't helping. Okay. The baby finds out that crying don't help after a right. while. Crying don't help. <laughs> okay. Thank you, uh, Charles. You did you did good this time.